could. Get, get them the right costumes. Give them the respect they deserve. Kind of interested to see uh, how Peachtree manages to get in against this character. Imagine some armor shenanigans along with just having some ridiculous frame data should help him out. And then Little Mac, definitely a character you can be boxing about the entire game. Getting that one hit is going to matter so much because of how hard he does hit. Mm. Being punished for that air slash. Play, seeing a bit of air Mac going onto the platform and then going for the Jolt Haymaker call out. Mm. Yeah, and there's a disadvantage. That, that is that is the, a button that does not care about Joel Haymaker is Shulk Fair, <laughs> for sure. And that is where Little Mac is going to struggle the most is in this disadvantage. He finds himself back in, but the big callouts from Monado not going to pay off. Oh, Monado, what are you doing? <laughs> Landing on the one move that says "Do not land on me." No fly zone being put out by the Little Mac. Now. Okay. Try not to get sucked into a little Mac Vortex. <laughs> Ooh, ready for the... Big forward air. Yeah. Good and call. The... Good call. Gave him that drift to, to recover high. Mm -hmm. And I, 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 don't, I, I definitely agree with that because while KO Punch can turn the tides, we're seeing Shulk already at kill percent, definitely. So all you need is one good forward smash, one good up smash. Can close it out. And we have just about an even game. Ooh, Ooh, preemptively hitting that uh, in case he tried to jump off. And the taunts coming out from Petrie, is this a signature thing that he's known uh, for? Or I mean, when he, just... when he, when he gets excited, for sure. <laughs> Maybe he's just not too fond of the Shulk matchup. This is yeah, definitely... I mean, this is probably not easy in this game. <laughs> right, for sure. Yeah, the no, he's going to going to close it. it out. That's like the third taunt I team throw out. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, I expected the counter. Very good. Like you said, Peachtree, one of the best in the business when it comes to recovering with this character. Yeah, he is very good at it. Oh, yeah, that's a punish. <laughs> Big call out, not gonna pay off, and we have an even game once more. Both of these characters so potent in this matchup. It seems like one hit could just end it, and we see the hit. Ooh. This could be it. We're gonna get hit by the, the trigger Haymaker. just barely. Ability, and that should do it. Yep. Not, <laughs> not going like to quite be able to make it back there. <laughs> little, little too much fly swatter that time. Um, oh, my bad. And theme of this matchup seems to be: I have a big sword. How are you going to get in? And I have great burst options. How are you going to deal with them? How are you going to get out? <laughs> right. Exactly. Which, you know. He gets out, but like, then he has to land, it's, and Little Max like. <laughs> and sometimes he gets out on those side blast zones, and that's definitely. Oh, was it on? Winner semi. Sorry about that, folks. Awesome. Thank Shadows of Orange Lightning for the catch. <laughs> Semis? Yeah. Okay. Awesome. This, uh, in that case, I think this might actually be, I think it might actually be best of five. I'm not 100% sure on that. Wow. We talked about the counter from Little Mac, but the big counter coming out from Shulk. Mm, same thing, and Minato was ready for it, but not the right punish. Scared off by the down smash. Not quite going to have the drift to make it back, ah. and that's definitely going to take it. If he'd done the down air with the double jump, he might have made it. <laughs> A lot of tricks, but not quite enough to make it back there, though. Other even game. Yeah, see, that's what, I was, that's what I was hoping to see. Armoring through Shulk's buttons. It's such a, a, a scary situation. You think about in traditional, more traditional fighting games, you have these big, bulky grapplers who have the super armor and everything and just want to get their hands on you, kind of represented like Little Mac. And then you have Dalsim with his big old stinky limbs trying to <laughs> stick you out. Get away from me with the forward air. Yeah, that's a punch. And yep, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Needed to jump there and 
Monado Messiah, knowing that that is the case. A pretty solid lead, but it could evaporate in a second from one good hit from the little, the littlest mech. Speed art, so he can't carry him as well. Oh, he didn't run off this platform in time. Ah, that's not good. But he saved his double jump. Mm -hmm. Really made it. So crucial. not that time though. Justified. Thank you. Awesome. Okay, so that's case actually. Best of five. Means we do get to see more of these two amazing players. What they've There's been showcasing so far. And with the KO punch on deck, this could be a one hit scenario. Ooh, yeah. The shield art gonna shield art saving him. Gonna save him. Still, a nice cents. 47, evening this game up, getting a little bit closer. Oh man. Definitely not insignificant. Get taking so much knockback because of the speed art. Jump art saying, you can't catch me. I know you don't have that kind yep, of air that ability. Very and good. the air slash gonna close it out. We see Nato Messiah go up 2-0. If there's any character that can edge guard Little Mac, it's definitely Shulk. <laughs> Lots of options. He doesn't have to commit too hard in one way or the other. For sure. We, we see people, characters you think of that uh, have an easy time edge guarding Little Mac. Shulk is definitely one of the first ones to come Disjoints to Disjoints help. Disjoints definitely help. Um, Bayonetta is probably one of them. Oh yeah, she can go up and all over the place. But and we have Disney Bayonetta being Sora. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Steve with all of his shenanigans, obviously. But running it right back to the small battlefield. Both the game, both these uh, these games have been very, very back and forth. Only for Monado to just catch him, and then it's over. Right. That seems <laughs> that seems like the the story of this matchup is: Can I catch you? Normally we see we see that kind of gameplay from Sonic, but in, in this case it's <laughs> can can you catch the little mech? Can you catch his jump? Can you catch oh, he does the jump haymaker maker. there? But oh, great oh, air dodge oh, there. Oh, and then the counter. See this KO punch come online. Can he land Ooh. and make use of it potentially? The air dodge to shift his momentum is really nice. Oh, open for the jab to disrupt Shulk into the KO punch. And it seems almost like he's trying to save this KO punch for the next stock. I know I can take it out here, but not going to be able to use it at all. Yeah, no. Nah. Big back air going to claim think. it. I think he was just looking for the opening. <laughs> oh, okay. Must have, caught, must have caught him running towards him. Caught, caught the back Ooh. foot. Ooh, that's <laughs> something we haven't seen this set is the, the, the up B. The up B. Right. Maybe, uh, maybe. Like, my auto off guard too. Maybe some potential from that going forward because Shulk has the down air. It's very big, but it's pretty linear. It's a fairly linear hitbox. So potentially some more up-y callouts from each tree to come. Uh, Great recovery, oh, okay. but not quite going to matter. Or nice, it does. Wait. He get off the ledge, Monado though. definitely thought he was going to jump. Yeah, the see? Jolt Haymaker going to get him back. It just catches you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> a huge lead for Peachtree here with the rage as well. So definitely not out of the question that he could take the third stock even here as well. The big down to that's probably going to do it. You have to think. There we go. Forward air is not weak enough to armor through. Speed forward air probably though. Each tree retaking center stage. Good call. Yeah, don't get hit by up tilt. <laughs> Looking almost like Smash 4 Mario there, just getting as many up tilts as possible. Okay, that's the big damage. call out with the forward smash, especially with the buster. Punch is online. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Both of them are ready. Both of them are ready. Very good play from both. At the weight this time, but... The double the counter. Being forward smash, gonna call it out. Exploded. And dare I say, this is even. <laughs> it sure is. 
Little Matt could be one hit, one jump call out away from a Monada Masayo 3-0. Peachtree not wanting to see that. Us not wanting to see that. We want to see more games from these two. Big forward so Getting close. How I do think, you get uh, back? I think uh, Monado has his shield probably ready. So if, if Peach can't get a one solid hit, Monado can probably make it back. Oh, yeah, there it is. But now it's popped. And using the now shield art now, not going to have it. Yep. Yeah, I'll do it. Caught the, caught the grab attempt. Peach Tree will hang in there for another round. And we see we started off on Pokemon Stadium 2, as is usual. And then we went to Small Battlefield, which is almost just like small Pokemon Stadium 2. So Basically. I wonder what the... Kind of and we're back to Small Battlefield. Three back games in a row, baby. <laughs> I love... I like Small Battlefield better better than PS2, actually. I think I think it's a, a dainty little stage. Whenever I'm I'm on the quick play, that's definitely what I'm, I'm picking. I also am biased because I like that I can play any song, but of course it's playing a Pokemon song making me eat my words immediately. <laughs> Anything would be better. I, I went to RVA yesterday and we had Amark's pick Route 209. Is that the, the slow song? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Which I mean fitting. It was it was Inman versus Young Link, so I mean there you go. <laughs> Definitely knowing the audience. But meanwhile there. uh Peach tree making short work of that stock. Some heavy smashes coming out. Almost making the 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 boy who can see the future look like the littlest Mac there, not being able to recover. <laughs> this is dicey. Don't want to see this. Nice. And looking very similar to the last game. Not a minute in. Both looking for a big read there, and uh, <laughs> neither were near close enough to do it. <laughs> just gotta hold it. Whenever you see that counter and you're already holding the smash attack, just just keep holding. You got it. A little it. bit longer. Just a little longer. <laughs> smash art yeah. coming out here. Oh, barely alive. Is smash art be being pretty weird in this matchup? Because obviously, little Mac, you don't you don't need a big hit to kill him. You just need no. a little bit to knock him off stage, but gonna close it out there regardless. The, the, the more knockback certainly helps. <laughs> right, of course, of course. Barely missing the smash. Ah. Uh... Big whiff grab there, but not a big um, punish. Peach, Peach nursing this lead here, but oh, right when I say it, that's not good. Ah, uh, but he had to catch the ledge. No jump, but not quite going to be able to cover it. Yeah, that move sucks. <laughs> <laughs> there are definitely yeah. a few questionable decisions when designing the counters in this game. Huh? <laughs> some of them are not okay, and some of them are also not okay, but for the exact for the wrong reason. reasons. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. All right, and just like that, we are two and two here. A bad comeback from Shrey, and we see the Greninja coming out. A little bit quicker of a character overall. Able to potentially box Mac a little bit better. A little bit quicker options. While still having the... disjoints. Forward air, nair, they're all, they all have a little bit disjoint on them, so. And permanent jump arc. <laughs> right, pretty much. It's also helpful as he's got a projectile if he wants to just pester Mac from a range every once in a while. Exactly, and potentially seeing the Hydro Pump annoy Mac's recovery because it doesn't trip the, the, the counter like Shulk's do. True, true. Maybe that is the thought process coming out from Anonymous Messiah. Oh, thank you. Uh, so far, uh, Peachtree seems mostly undeterred, though. It's uh, still just as even as this set has been. Right, and that's just a testament to how close and skill level <laughs> these two players are. Big forward smash. And another thing that maybe is Greninja having a lot easier time mixing up his recovery, messing with the timing of these down smashes from each tree. Mm. That's a little more uh, 
or nuance. Shulk, Shulk definitely is just go to ledge or don't. <laughs> Not gonna get the jump read there. Got it there. But <laughs> gonna get it there. You're making me eat my own words. Commentator curse live in the flesh. Hoping for that uh, up B, which probably would have KO'd, but now you're just eating 40, 48. Big conversion and Mac not having the landing options to deal with the huge Greninja. And then but he just punches him. <laughs> then he just punches him. Isn't that isn't that little Mac in a nutshell though? Just 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 punch him. You mm -hmm. punch him, you're 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 doing pretty good. <laughs> and we're slip countering. All over the place. Slipping and sliding. If Greninja can do it, we can do it too. Yes, sir. Yeah, what is nice about that permanent jump art you were mentioning is if uh, if uh, Minato's ever in a bad spot, he can just jump away because what's Mac going to do? Jump after him? Right. <laughs> not like Shulk where he has to guess. And not quite going to be able to use the Hydro Pump to call out the recovery there. Getting hit. But back in the same situation again. Continually getting back. Making it look like... Almost easy, right? <laughs> right. Maybe max recovery isn't isn't that bad. Blows my mind. It blows my mind seeing max recover. Also, potentially, we've seen Nana Messiah playing mostly Shulk today. Maybe a bit of rust from the Greninja in these edge guard situations specifically. The up be gonna close it out there. That's the thing. A lot of Greninja's best buttons are are aerials, so he caught him trying to jump. For the punish and it just wasn't fast enough right and greninja not having a bunch of fast out of shield options so what i see oh. a lot of them do is they'll just full hop and try and you know oh, reset that, that vertical neutral all right last and we game, have last stock even game even <laughs> every time forward smash hits i'm just like <laughs> like he's hitting you right yeah. in the chest mm -hmm. and slip counters very annoying move <laughs> Just think like, oh, I punished him, and it's just like, nope. oh, he has another one ready. <laughs> Good jump. Calling out the jumps again. Thing about this is, oh, the big up smash oh, gonna close big it out up there. Up smash closing 